Good afternoon, everyone. How are you all doing? Good afternoon. Yes, yes, fine, thank you. How are you, ma'am? How are you, ma'am? How are you, ma'am? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Okay. Today, my dear students, we are going to revise lesson number three. Lesson number three. I want Anom to unmute her device and read the first okay. stanza of the poem. Lesson okay. number three, titled The Champa Flower. And based on the lesson, I'll be asking you some questions. Let us revise it so that we are absolutely confident to appear for the examination. Come on, Anna. Read the first stanza of the poem. Lesson three, a trap of luck. Suppose I became a trap of luck just for fun and grew on a branch high up that tree mm -hmm. and flew in the wind with water and dance upon the newly budded leaves. Mm. Would you know me, mother? Mm. You would call, baby, where are you? And I would laugh to myself. And keep I calling. would laugh to myself. I would laugh to, I should laugh to myself and keep quiet, quiet. Mm. I should slyly open my petals and watch you at your work. Okay, um, that's enough, my dear. That's it. That's mm -hmm. it. Well read. Thank you, Anna. But well, I think you, uh, in between, you went a little too fast, right, Anna? So try to reduce the speed. Otherwise, things will not be clear to the people who are listening. Okay, Anna? Keep that in mind. Good effort, my dear. Thank you. Reeve, unmute, please. Yes, ma'am. Reeve, I want you to read the next stanza. Come on, Reeve. Rarbin Tagore. Rabindranath Tagore. Tagore. Rabindranath Tagore. Rabindranath okay. Tagore. Tagore. Okay. I want you to read from when after your bath. What? Yes, read. It's in the textbook. Textbook. Ma'am, in the ma'am today daily test is there. No. Ma'am, today's English literature test. Yeah, I know. I learned. That is why we are revising. Okay. When after the mid day. When meet. after your bath. When. When, when after, after your you, bath. When after your bath. Hmm. With hmm. wet hair spread on your shoulders. Yes. To walk through the shadow of mm. the champa tree. Okay. Little, through the shadow of the champa tree. To the? To the little coat. Um, coat to the little coat. To the little coat. When you say. Where you. Your, when, where you. Where. Where you say. You know. What, Prayers. Would you would not you would the notice the scent scent of the, the flower, flower, but not know that I came that from it me. came I T it that it came from me. That Ma it came from me. Please don't speak in between. When after the mid Okay, that's day enough. Meet. That's enough. Okay, Ma good effort. Good. Vaiga, yeah. unmute. I request everybody to keep yes, their devices muted and don't unmute them till I call out your names. Okay, Daksha? Yeah, Vaiga, please start reading. Okay. Hmm. When, when after the meat day Meal. M-E-A-L. Meal. Meal, you sat at the window, window reading Ramayana yes. and the tree's shadow mm. fell over, fell over mm. your hair and your lap. Yes, I should mm. fling. F L I N G fling fling my wheel 
little shadow. We little shadow on the page of your book. Okay. Just where you are reading. Mm. But mm. would you guess that it was the tiny shadow of your little child? Okay, good effort, Vaika. You are trying to read it quite well. Thank you. Joanne, please read the last stanza of the poem. Okay, ma'am. When in the evening you went to the cow shed with the light lamp in your hand, mm -hmm. I should suddenly drop onto the earth again and be your own baby once more mm. and beg you to tell me a story. Mm. Where have you been, you naughty child? Mm. I want to tell you, mother. That's what you and I should say then. That's what you and I would say then. Okay, good effort, Joan. You have tried to read it very well. Wonderful, thank you. Okay, my dear students, have you been able to recollect the poem? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yes, ma'am. I have some general questions about this poem for you. Mitra, unmute, tell me who is the poet of the poem? Who is the poet? Sorry? Louder, please. Yeah, say it once again. I cannot hear your voice. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, please say the name once again. Rabindranath Tagore. Very good. Rabindranath Tagore is the poet of the poem, The Champa Flower. Okay, good, Mitra. Thank you. Rida. Rida, which is the highest prize that is awarded to... Rabindranath Tagore for his immense mm -hmm. contribution towards literature. Which is the highest mm -hmm. award given to him? Do you remember all that? No? Mm -hmm. You are supposed to remember. Who remembers the highest prize given to Rabindranath Tagore? Yes, Advait Krishna. Advait. Nobel the prize. Nobel Prize, yes. Rabindranath Tagore was awarded with the Nobel Prize in Literature for his immense contribution. Okay, good. Let us move ahead and discuss the exercises to make sure that all of you remember and have understood what we have learned. Ujwal, unmute. Where would the champa flower grow? Where would the champa flower grow? Hi. I where, my dear? I up. up where? I up on, on the, the tree. On the tree, yes. The champa flower, or the boy who wished to be a champa flower, wishes to bloom on the highest branch of the tree. The highest branch. Okay, good effort, Ujwal. Yadunandan, unmute. What would the mother do after her midday meal? What would the mother do after her midday meal? Yadunandan. Ma'am, read. Read. Read, yes. Where would she sit and read? Tell me the place and tell me the correct answer. Where would she sit and read the ram? Read what? Ma'am, window. Yes, she would sit. Does she sit on the window or near the window? Hmm? Near window. Near the window. Very good. And what is she reading? Um, Very good. The mother plans to sit by the window or near the window and read the Ramayana. Very good. I'm happy to see that Yadunandan was thinking and then he gave me the answer. Very good, my dear. Good job. Jovak, unmute. When would the child yes, drop back onto the earth? Yes, welcome. Jovak, when would yes, the child drop back onto the earth? What time of the day does the child plan to drop back on the earth? Cow shed. What time, I asked? Does he plan to drop back onto the earth at night, in the evening or the next morning? 
Ma'am. Ah, mm, uh, wait. Evening. Mom is muted, guys. Ma'am. Evening. Yeah. In the evening. Say it clearly. In the evening. In the evening. In the evening. Yes. Okay. Good effort, Jovak. Thank you. Dev Daksh. What would the mother ask when the child dropped back to the earth? What would the mother ask at that time? The mother asked. Hmm. The mother would ask. The mother would ask. Hmm. What would she ask? When Where have you been? Yes. Where are you been? Where have you been, my little child? Where she are has you been being searching my... for her child throughout the day, right? So yes. when she gets her son back, gets her child back in the evening, she would definitely ask her, where have you been, my dear child? Won't she ask Dev Daksh? Where are you been, my child? Where child? have you been, my dear child? Yes. Okay, Joe. Uh, Dev Daksh. Good effort. Thank you. Thank Abhinav, you. unmute. Let's move yes. ahead with revising the meanings. Budded. What is the meaning of budded, Abhinav? Newly flowered. Newly flowered. Not flowered. Newly flowered. Newly flowered. Yes, good. But it means newly flowered. Okay, good. Thank you. Aiden, the meaning of quite, Q U I T E, quite. Aiden, there are two similar words in the same line. Quite quiet. What is the meaning of quite? T E, Q U I T E. Ma'am, can I? No, others, please. please. Aiden, give me the answer. No, I see. No, I'm not asking the antonym. I'm asking the meaning, that too, of the word quite. Q U I T E. Quite. Right. Almost. Almost. Yes, Farmis. Did I ask you to give the answer? Why don't you understand, my dear students? Please try to avoid answering in between. Okay? I will ask each one of you. Ma'am, can I? Farmis, wait. Okay. Now, the next question goes to Aradhya. Are you ready, Aradhya? What is the meaning yes. of slyly? Slyly. Secretly, Vinny. Secretly, Vinny. Secretively, yes. The meaning of slyly is secretively, in a very secretive manner. Thank you, okay, ma'am. Good, good, Aradhya. Then, Devarsh, unmute. Tell me the meaning of fling. Fling. Uh, to throw something across. To throw, not throw. Throw. To throw something across. Say properly, to throw. To throw. throw. Something across. Yes, very good. To fling means to throw something across. Good, Devarsh. Thank you. Brahmadat, the meaning of we. W E E. We. Hmm? Brahmadat, what is the meaning of we? Unmute. Unmute. You don't remember? Wee little shadow. The child plans to throw his wee little shadow. What is the meaning of wee? W E E. Matradatan, unmute. Wee. Very small. Very small. Yes, fantastic. The meaning of wee is very small. Understood, Matradatan? Ah, sorry. Uh, Brahmadat. We means very small. Okay, good effort, Madhur Dattan. Thank you. Lakshmika, let's move ahead with the antonyms. The opposite of quiet. Quiet. Afrin, mute. Yes? What is the antonym of quiet? Uh, she's not able to unmute, I think. Okay, I will ask. Hmm. Rida, Rida, 
Yes, tell me the antonym of quiet. Noisy. Noisy. Yes, you're right. Okay, good. Antony. Antony. Tell me the antonym of wet. Yes, ma'am. Tell me the antonym of wet. Cry. Dry. Cry. Is it cry or dry? Dry. Dry, yes. What is the meaning of wet? Something that has water in it or on it, yes? If we go yeah. out in the rain, what happens? We get wet. There is water all over our body, right? Yes. But if we are not going out in the rain, now all of us are, are members at school, you all are at your homes, right? So are yes, we wet? Yes. Are we wet? No. no, we are dry. Dry. We are dry. So the right. antonym of wet is dry. 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 Okay, good effort, Anthony. Thank you. Thank you. Ananda Krishnan. Ananda Krishnan. Ma'am. Yeah. Ma'am. Ma you are facing network issues, I think. Yes, I can see that your video is blurred. It's not clear. Okay, Ananda Krishnan. Ma'am, can you hear me now? Yeah, I can, but your video is not clear. Ma'am, Lakshmika. Yeah, I know Lakshmika. Ananda Krishnan. Ma'am, can I? The can I? After, after. Before. Before, very good. Okay, Lakshmika, tell me the antonym of Lakshmika. tiny, tiny. Tiny antonym. Lakshmika is not able to hear due to network issues. Okay, Austin. Austin, what is the antonym of tiny? Huge. Huge, yes. Very, very good. Okay, Afrin, tell me the past tense of shake. Past tense. Um, can you tell me more? Past um, tense. Can I? Pa others. Um, Please wait. Then. Past tense of shake. Afrin. Shook. Shook. Spelling. S H O O K. S H O O K. Shook. Okay, very good. Advait Krishna. Past tense of Man. come. Came. Past tense of come. Came. 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 Very good. Spelling. C A M E. C A M E. Very good, Advait. Okay, then Abel Vargis, past tense of fling, fling. Past tense of fling. Farmer said properly. Yes? Tell me the answer. Okay, Afif, give me the answer. Famous, famous. One more time, famous. Ma'am. Ma'am, mute your device, please. Plung. You need to give a chance to everybody. Plung. Yes, Ma'am. Afif, yes? Plung. Very good. Spelling? F-L-U-N-G. Okay, very good. F-L-U-N-G. Flung. Okay, good. Shreveni, unmute. What is the past tense of grow? Grow. Grow. Spelling? G-R-E-W. G-R-E-W. Grew. The past tense of grow is grew. Okay, very good. Now, are you thorough with lesson number three? Are you, we have revised it now. Are you able to yes. remember everything? Yes. 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 Now I have mutual yes. devices. Please, yes. mutual devices. I have some general questions from the poem. Reeve, unmute. What yes, does the child's mother carry with her when she goes towards the cow shed in the evening? What does the mother lamb. carry with her? A light lamp. A lighted lamp, not light lamp. A lighted lamp. A Say lighted again, Reeve. Lamp. A, A lighted, lighted lamp. lamp. A lighted, a lighted lamp. Okay, very good. 
Yeah, then, okay. What is the name of the book that the mother is reading? Mm, Anthony, what is the name of the book that the child's mother is reading? Anthony? Ramayana. Ramayana, very good. Okay. Then, uh, Joanne, what does a child plan to do when, her mo when his mother is reading the Ramayana? Child would throw his V shadow onto the page of the Ramayana. Where? Where his mother was reading. Very good. Onto the page of the Ramayana where his mother was reading. Good. Now, are you able to recollect both the lessons one and three? Yes. Yes. With it? yes. All of yes. you? Yes. Okay. Now, I want all of you to take the literature workbook. Okay. Workbook and be on page number two. Page number two. Let me share the screen. Yes. Just give me a second. Page number two. Page number two. We will revise the exercise on young ones of animals. Okay. So let us first recollect Ma that. Ma'am, the P T test the book is the. Sorry. Ma'am, the exam has workbook. Workbook. Yeah, the workbook is here. Ma'am. Like that, it will be workbook also. Of course, I want everybody to take the workbook now. We are going to revise the workbook exercises, okay? Sorry? I cannot hear you. The PT test workbook to learn. Yes, of course. Okay. Now, Devanandan, unmute. Tell me, the young one of a duck is called a? Duckling. Very good. Spelling? D-U-C-K-L-I-N-G. Say again. D-U-C-K-L-I-N-G. Very good. D U C K. L I N G duckling. Okay, that's good. Abel Vargis, the young one of a pig. Abel Vargis, the young one of a pig is called. Hmm, unmute. The young one of a pig is called. Hmm. Piglet. Sorry? The young one of a pig. Piglet. Yes. Piglet. P-I-G-L-E-T. Abel Vargis, repeat three times. Piglet. Piglet. Spelling? P-I-G-L-E-T. One more time. P I G. L E T. Read the word. Piglet. Not piglet. 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 Yes, that's better. Okay, good. Now, Austin, the young one of a goose. Goosling or gosling? Gosling. Gosling. Spelling? G O S L I N G L I N G G O S L I N G Gosling. Okay, very good, Austin. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, yeah, welcome, Rida. The young one of a frog. Tab tablet. Tad. Tadpole. Tadpole. Yes, spelling. T A D P O L E. Yes, very good. T A D P O L E. Tadpole. Mitra, the young one of a deer. The young one of a deer. Fawn. Fawn. Spelling? F A W N. 
F A W N fawn. Okay. Yadunandan, the young one of a sheep. Hmm? The young one of a sheep. Apple. Spelling? Apple. Spelling, please. A. Hmm. A. Hmm. N. Hmm. B. B. L A M B. Lamb. The young one of a sheep is called a lamb. Yeah. Okay, good effort, my dear. Thank you. Okay. Now, out of these, I'm going to ask a few only. Aradhya, tell me the young one of a kangaroo's name. The young one of a kangaroo. Joy. Very good. Spelling? J O Y. J O E Y. Say again. J O E Y. Very good. J O E Y. Joy. Okay, thank you. Thank you, ma'am. You're welcome. Aldrin Joby, can you hear me? Aldrin Joby. The young one of a goat. Goat. What is the young one of a goat called as? Aldrin Joby. Yeah, give me the answer. The young one of a goat is called? Kid. Kid, yes. Spelling? What is the spelling of kid? I think she, he is facing network issues. K-I-D, kid. K-I-D, kid. Okay, good. Okay, Aldrin. Aldrin. Then, Jovak, the young one of a horse. Yes, ma'am. The young one of a horse is called a? Fool. Fo fool or foal? Fool. Fool, yes. Spelling? F-O-A-L. F-O-A-L. Fool. If you write fool, the answer will be wrong. Okay? So the spellings you have to remember. F-O-A-L. Fool. Okay, good effort, my dear. That's enough. We have done uh, quite a lot of revising the young names. Now I want everybody to move to page number six. Page number six of the same book. Same book. Have a look at the picture. I'm going to twist the questions and ask you. Anthony Babu, unmute. Tell me, what is the boy doing? I want answers in complete sentences only. What is the boy doing, Anthony? Wiping the floor. Wiping is the look at what the boy is having in his hand and tell me what is the activity that he is doing. I have told you there are specific words to be used for each me. activity. This is the Where boy. Where is my Cleaning. Cleaning. All are doing cleaning, right? Yes. What is the boy doing? Sweeping the floor. Hmm? Sweeping the floor. Yes, the boy is, oh, your voice is not clearly audible. The boy is sweeping the floor. Very good. Okay, thank you. Matrudatan. What is the girl doing? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. What is the girl doing? Look at what she has in his... Cleaning. Cleaning. Everybody is cleaning, my dear. In this picture, everybody is cleaning. Cleaning. No, the girl. What wiping is the, the girl? table. Wiping the table. Yes, the girl is wiping the table. Okay, good. And what is the father doing? Yadunandan, what is the father doing? I'm cleaning the plane. What is the father doing? 
Look at the picture and tell. Playing. Sorry. Breaking the dishes. Washing. Washing. Washing the cleaning. dishes. 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 The father is washing the dishes. Okay, very good. Now, which room of the house is the family in? Uh, Advait Krishna, which room of the house is the family in? Family was in kitchen. The family is, not was. In the question, the word is is, right? So, in the answer also, it's better that we use the word is. Say again, Advait. The family is in the? Family is in the kitchen. In the kitchen. kitchen. Yes, very good. The family is in the kitchen. Okay, good. Thank you, Advai. Ujwal, unmute. Tell me the correct spelling for the word relative. R-E-L-A-T-I-V-E. -E. Yes, very good. R-E-L-A-T-I-V-E. -E. Relative. Promise? Please keep it on the side and unmute your device. Unmute. Tell me I the stop. correct spelling of the word peace. Peace. P I E C E. Yes, P I E C E. Peace. Very good, Farmis. Shriveni, tell me the correct spelling for calendar. Calendar. Very good. C A L E N D A R. Calendar. Vaiga, the correct spelling for neighbor. Yes, ma'am. Neighbor. N E I G H B O O U R. N E I G H B O U R. Neighbor. You're right, Vaiga. Thank you. Thank you. Then, Brahmadat, tell me the correct spelling for library. Library. Hmm. Library. L. I. B. Uh, after that, uh, L I B R A R Y. This is the correct spelling for the word library. You understand? L I B R A R Y. Library. Okay. Library. Afif, tell me the correct spelling for whistle. Whistle. W H I S T L E. Whistle. W H I S T L E. Whistle. Okay. Very good. Now, second. Rohan Bose, can you hear me? Rohan. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Unjumble these letters and make the correct word. T O H B R E R. Brother. Brother. Very good spelling. T e R O T H E R. Very good. B R O T H E R. Brother. Thank you. Devarsh. O C U I N S. Cousins. Spelling. C O U S I N. Very good. C O U S I N. Cousin. Very good. Thank you. Mm. Jovac, try the last one. T E M H O R. Mother. Mother. Spelling. M O. T H E R M O T H E R Mother. Okay, very good. So, my dear students, today we have revised the entire portion, right? Yes. Lesson three yes. and the workbook all exercises also we have revised. 
I hope yes. everybody is absolutely yes, confident about what all we have learned. Yes, um, there is still, yes, still some time is there. So I want you to go through all the exercises that we have and okay. the lessons. Yes. Yeah. Thank you very much. Wish you all the very yes, best for today. Bye, bye. Thank you. Bye, bye. 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 Bye, bye